Hello and welcome back to another video. In this one we're going to take a look at my Black Sabbath CD collection. I've shown these before but this will be in full 1080p HD. Starting off the Creative Sounds version of Black Sabbath's first album uh, and self-titled album. I think it was their only self-titled but this disc was made in Holland under a uh, license from uh, Warner Brothers. <laughs> it sounds really good for what it is. Very enjoyable. Uh, that reminds me I need to replace my DVD slash CD player drive in my computer. That's primarily what I listen to this album on, but I have boom boxes and stuff to listen to on. Anyways, the cover uh, image is kind of kind of blurry. You just get the original track listing on the back. Um, this is probably very close to what an original CD copy of this looked like on the back end. Um, just original album tracks here. It's kind of discolored. Not much in the way of the booklet, just a, you know, album cover put on front and information on the back about the CD format. So here's a 1988 Warner Brothers version of the same album. Very common and very inexpensive. Sounds not quite as good as the other version, but you do get a cool image on the back, same as the record. Um, unfortunately, there's not an analog version of this album in print or... I think there's one in, a, in the box set, maybe that's not, not digital, maybe it is analog, I'm not sure I heard about that recently, but Moving forward, Black Sabbath Prenoid. A lot of these I bought in a uh, collection. I think this is part of it. Maybe not. What a fantastic, fantastic album! Great uh, cover, showing a, a warrior with a blue sword. Kind of sci-fi-ish, I guess. He's wearing a <laughs> a motorcycle helmet. You have songs like War Pigs, Paranoid, I've talked about these before, Planet Caravan, Iron Man, Hand of Doom, uh, and Fairies with Boots. Much like the other CD, you know, just silver. Sound is really good on this one. Excuse me. And these are really in no particular order that I can think of. Black Sabbath Master of Reality, another creative sounds version, which actually sounds pretty good. Looks exactly, almost exactly the same as the other. So you have, that's very plain back. So on Master's Reality you have songs like Sweet Leaf, Children of the Grave, and Into the Void. Another Creative Sounds uh, Black Sabbath album, this time Sabotage. Once again, the image is kind of kind of blurry, kind of just lacking definition, but the disc sounds great. You have songs like Hole in the Sky, Symptom of the Universe, and Am I Going Insane, Radio Edit. This did suffer some damage to the uh, cover. That's fine. This this whole uh, almost every CD in this lot was only like thirty dollars, so I how can, I'm not gonna complain. But yeah, just great Sabbath album. They were getting it just seemed like they got heavier as time went on, but then their last two albums were pretty not that great in my opinion. And I'll show those. Uh, I think this is a Warner edition. Yes. Sabbath, bloody Sabbath. Just awesome cover here, image on the cover. You have a evil monster trying to get this woman, or man, I'm sorry. Very metal album cover. So we have the title track, Cyber Cadabra. Uh, Killing Yourself to Live. Which, what a good album from 74. 
I'll show the inside, another cool image in there. A uh, man dying in bed or something. I can't tell. There's the CD, just like the 1988 versions. Uh, and that spindle's broken. Black Sabbath, volume four. So it came out in 19... Yeah, these are out of order, but you have Changes, Supernaut, Snowblind, Laguna Sunrise, This is Warner, yeah. Silver Disc Edition, made in USA. Uh, we sold rock and roll. F um, yeah, Black Sabbath's uh, greatest hits. We sold our soul for rock and roll. It was a two-record set, condensed down into one CD. So you just have you know the title, uh, Black Sabbath, The Wizard, Paranoid, War Pigs, Iron Man. Uh, Fairies with Boots, Changes, Sweet Leaf, Children of the Grey, that's a great one. But a S Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath, Am I Going Insane, there's that radio edit again. Snowblind, Nib, er, and Nib. Warner edition on CD. I think I, there's something in the booklet. Yep. That image there, not sure what that's about. Oh, that's it. Blockbuster Best of Collection, featuring 14 Black Sabbath Hard Rock and Heavy Metal Classics. There's Warner Brothers logo, 1976. That's when the album originally, originally came out. And I think after, you know, that was really their heyday. <coughs> uh, Creative Sounds, Greatest Hits Collection. Uh, very poorly printed cover. This is just something they made, I guess, to compete with Black Sabbath's other greatest hits that I just showed. Great songs on here. Doesn't sound very good, though. Almost trashed it, but decided to keep it just to keep it. Uh, hang on. 76 and 78. Black Sabbath Technical Ecstasy. This just got the remix treatment here not too long ago, and a box set, and a vinyl, and a single CD release. I considered buying it, but I'm not a huge fan of this this one. I can't even tell you <coughs> the songs that are good on it because I just don't recognize them. <coughs> I mean, it's not a horrible record. Uh, I think You Won't Change Me is good. Uh, Rock and Roll Doctor. Uh, none of these recordings they play on the radio. These off this album. And it's a Warner Brothers edition. Very, very uh, <coughs> almost 80s, you know, with the cover you know I think very futuristic and interesting in my opinion I'll show the book because I have just plenty of time lyrics and notes for 19 okay. oh they went on a two year Recording and performing hiatus. That's interesting. Looks like they did a lot of output though in the 70s, uh, early 70s. Black Sabbath, Never Say Die. Again, not that great. You have the title track. Uh, Hard Road might be good. I haven't listened to these, uh, the older, or sorry, their lesser, their later material in quite some time. This is Warner as well, yeah. There's that. Don't know if this will get re released, not sure. It has a, uh, keeps with the, uh, jet motif inside. That's the collection, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Come back for another video coming soon.